There is major concern about the financial future of Spring Branch ISD. The district says that lawmakers need to increase the basic allotment of to $1,000 per student. Right now, the proposed increase is $50 per student. This morning at 9 a.m., the district's board of trustees will meet to discuss the budget. I'm joined by Spring Branch ISD Superintendent Dr. Jennifer Blaine. Um, Dr. Blaine, help me make sense of this. Do you know why this is happening? Well, um, we as a as a community, we began advocating. We knew this legislation se this legislative session was coming in the fall. We brought a group of parents together to really educate them on the not only on the state finance system, but how it impacts the Spring Branch Independent School District. So we've been prepared to start advocating in January, which is what we've done. We started in January, going to Austin, talking uh, talking with legislators, trying to help them understand not just at the state level how the budget will operate, but how it's and it specifically impact the Spring Branch Independent School District. So um, we're, we're, we're advocating and um, we are asking for an increase in the basic allotment. We believe that's what our students need and deserve to be successful. All right, but if the allotment is not raised by $1,000, what kind of cuts is the district gonna have to make? Where are parents going to see this being taken away from? So we sent a message out to our community uh, explaining that if we do not see an increase, a significant increase, I'll say, on the basic allotment, we are facing a $50 million budget deficit. So that could mean anything from cutting programs, services, um, instructional uh, interventions. We're also talking about the backbone of the system. So we're talking about operations, safety and security, and the like. And so as it pertains to Spring Branch ISD specific budget, we are facing some pretty devastating cuts if we don't see a significant increase on the basic allotment. Well, how can parents in the community then help to advocate for the budget increase? Well, as, as I was saying, our parents, our board of trustees, our parents and our community have done just a tremendous job. And so a big thank you to them for their advocacy thus far. What we've been told by legislators is that they want to hear from us. And so our community has been advocating uh, since the beginning of the, actually since the fall. They've been in Austin. They've been emailing. They've been calling. And so what I would say to our community is don't give up hope. Um, keep calling. Keep emailing. Keep sending the message that the Spring Branch Independent School District needs a significant significant increase on the basic allotment. And I will also say this doesn't just impact Spring Branch. This actually impacts every school district across the state of, of Texas. All five million students in Texas are depending on our legislators to do the right thing and significantly increase that basic allotment. All right, Dr. Blaine, thank you so much for joining us and giving us that insight this morning. We really appreciate it. Thank you.